Hey, what's up guys? So I know Early Decision for Hopkins recently came out, so I'm going to be making a video on why I chose Hopkins and why you should too. Or shouldn't. I mean, if you got into Harvard, I'll be honest, you should probably go there. Now before I start, Hopkins is not sponsoring me to make this video. This isn't me trying to drop some propaganda on you guys like, Oh boy, Hopkins, his place is Nirvana! You have to go here! No, that's not what I'm trying to do. But I do believe this is a great school, and let me tell you why. Now to start off, the first reason I chose Hopkins was uh, low-key because it was a top 10 school. I mean, at the time. Now in all seriousness, rankings are important. I know everyone gonna be with me like Big Fish Little Pond, bro. But hear me out. When you're surrounded by great people, it's a blessing because you have no choice but to be an all-around good person yourself. Now, of course, most top schools, you're going to find people who are cutthroat AF. Like, I'd be texting someone from No Save Token class, and they'd be leaving me on red. Like, boy, I saw you read my text, my guy. Help me out, bro. But people work hard. They're not fake. they diverse AF, you know. And people are going to be thankful for free time all the time here. Now, weirdly enough, it's come to a point where people work so hard that if you see someone looking like a bum, your first reaction is, oh, man, they definitely have three tests this week. Not, oh, man, this guy don't know how to dress AF. Now, if they look like a bum every day, they're probably BME. Next up, Baltimore. It's a great city. Now, have you heard rumors about Baltimore being rough out here in these streets? Kinda is, I'll be honest. All you gotta do is not look at your phone when you're walking on sketchy streets at night. That's all you gotta do. I know that's hard when your homies be tweeting the wildest stuff recently, but those tweets will be there when you get to your desired destination. So get off your phone. Be street smart. And if you got a friend, walk with a friend. If you got a squad, walk the squad. Because many times you're gonna hear people get robbed at a location you're at like 10 seconds ago. But you gotta be street smart, bruh. You probably had a whole squad with you. If a dude see you hanging by a street corner, they ain't gonna gang up 1v6. They don't work on the streets. I also wanna talk about the Hopkins size. You know, it's a small campus, 5,000 students, and the shortest walk is probably 10 minutes to class, which is low-key important AF. I didn't realize this, but being able to go to class, then walk back to my room, take a nap, and then go to class again, it's a blessing that us Hopkins students have. Like my boy at Berkeley, once he leaves the house, he looks like he about to go on a road trip because he don't come back till night. Also, Hopkins is a closed campus, and because it's enclosed, there's a lot of stuff going on, on campus like acapella shows, fundraising events. You also got uh, maybe yo-yo performances. Even when you got Baltimore and DC at our doorsteps, people are supportive and willing to see what you're doing. Last thing I want to talk about is that this place is a huge research university, and that means you've got to be taught by some pretty important people. Like Deadass, my homie out here who taught me C and C++, he patented his own algorithm. He had this algorithm in his back pocket like it's no big deal. And you know, I wouldn't even notice if it wasn't for his other professors just hyping him up, you know. It's like, if there was a Hollywood academia, these dudes would be getting Emmys. These professors have more followers than I'll ever have subscribers on my channel. It's, it's a crazy world out here. So to conclude, Hopkins is a great overall school to go to. If you got accepted recently, congratulations for getting in. And if you're still applying to schools, you got about 16 days to change your mind and apply to Hopkins. Hey, you know what would be a great idea? Did you see that little boy over here? It'd be so fun if we start taking our jackets and start whipping him with our jackets. And she'd just go up to me, she'd be like, Whoop! And I'd be like, oh, okay. I'm telling you, they don't play no games in any school. 